and then I'm just gonna do the same to What's the sound now? <coughs> oh, basically, I might need to get new headsets because these ones seem to be good, but they just seem a bit wrong. change that a bit because I think it is a bit too low on my last video stream they said they couldn't hear the sound properly okay so now I've just got to send the link Okay, I'll sort it. Just one final check on the sound, see if it's okay, and then we'll get going. Okay, this felt good, I think, hopefully, it sounds good. Yeah, I should be happy with that. Yeah, 
last start. I'm not sure if people are going to be joining us, but hopefully they will. <coughs> so where we left it off, I am into the final world, and I can also access the game show, which was embarrassing because I could, I didn't um, get it. And I've just got to find where that blasted. I keep forgetting where the puzzle thing is because it's um you find the picture of the last puzzle. Well, you find the picture of the last world somewhere close, so I've just got to remember I think I swam to it. So if I find somewhere to swim, maybe that's it. Delvin, <coughs> we are on to the final world and we're on to the quiz show as well. Ah, here it is. And I've opened it, yes! We now have Click Clockwood open, and now we... I'm not even sure I've got actually a cauldron that's close to... Um, <coughs> opening up, the, you know, group of to the world, so I'll just take the long way for sod reason. Let's see if we can remember how to get there. close to beating this. I've got uh, another world to complete. I've got to get the last four jiggies in another world which I got frustrated with. And <clears throat> what's we got? I've got I think if I'm, I've got to have all the notes in every level and I have missed a few. So I'll have to get them as well. Because there's all you always need to collect things, and no, you do. In games like this, you had to collect everything. Can you actually destroy these? Because I've got no gold feathers. Oh, you can. Did not know that. That was just me guessing. He surprised me in this game too. That's how I surprise you. <clears throat> oh yeah, the radiant ball. The one enemy you cannot defeat. You can knock it out, but that's it. So here we go. Click clock woods. Where it has four worlds in one. And they all interconnect with each other, which is kind of like 
a preview of what you're going to get in the second one because the worlds are connected in some way. You can't get a Jiggy in one world without doing something in another. Which I found very, very frustrating. And then I was like, you can't do this without learning a move and you won't learn this move until three worlds away. So let us go to spring. Okay, I've got 19 Mumbo tokens. I think I'm going to need some more. Problem is, you got that. I'm going to need gold feathers for that because you can't do anything with them. I'm gonna find that part annoying because it always has like a cutscene when doing that. It's like, yes, we know, we got it. Oh no, doesn't do it every time. Oh, it's been a while since I played this. I just gotta try and see if I can remember all the <laughs> jigsaw puzzles because it got ten in so many. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> ten worlds between divided between four. Um, okay, that's a seed varieties. Oh, here we go again. Back in a moment. Sorry about that. My daughter decided, you know what, I've been too quiet. I'm going to make sure mum knows I'm not in sleep. I still can't figure out how eggs do this. And now I have to wait. The entire season. Just to get that one jigsaw piece. Sorry, wrong setting. I should have heard that in it. I've got to wait for the entire season just for that jiggy. Well, I think we've got it till it's. I think it's autumn, we've got to wait till. There's one burst skull. Quickly go and have a look. <laughs> I'm okay, Delvin. It's just telling him my daughter coming coming down for some reason. Okay, I just need six more. I don't know why, because she's been quiet this entire time. I thought she was actually asleep, but now she's not. 
Wake up. I ain't got enough, but I'm still waking you up. Anything behind you? Nope. Okay. See you later. Oh, there's big mama bustles. There's one. So I just need five more now. So I said, did I go through that? Because that would be not fair if there's a glitch in the game. Enough to be playing the division, and I've been doing harder levels, and then all of a sudden it glitches, and I die, and I'm like, "Are you kidding me?" Because the bad guy is not there, and all of a sudden the bad guys are there, or your character just freezes, and you're like, "Come on!" Well, I've actually been enjoying the division. I think my brother's getting angry because I've managed to do things that you can't. Like, uh, I managed to do some harder levels than he is, and I'm a bit ahead of him. I mean, I'm now at the max level, which is cool. The only thing I don't like about it is it is a. Um, multiplayer game and trying to find people to play with you can be difficult because it's like destiny if you haven't done the raid no one was going to play with you because you haven't done the raid but the only way to do the raid is to find someone to play with so it kind of puts you in a really annoying circle Why, why have Banjo glitched to punish me? What have I done? I mean, okay, I have killed him a few times. I did try and do the same jiggy over and over again. But at least um, Phil got a lot of laughs from them. Yeah, I think I've only managed to do... Two raids in the first Destiny and one in the second and that took me if I calculated the hours it took me days to find people who would gladly go with me days possibly weeks oh it took me weeks actually oh no bugger bugger please land on water please land on you right, close yeah, it took me day it took me weeks and months just to find someone to play with me. So I just I just really gave up on Destiny. Because as I said, it is a great game, but it's just mentally frustrating trying to find people nice enough to give you a chance and play with you. I was, just, I was getting to the good parts as well. I've tried to make six friends, but so far I, I just don't have any. Hence, I'm Billy now, mates. I played but stopped because my team made me do all the work. Yeah, the problem is, it's designed that you need six people. <laughs> Oi! I mean, I think I did traversing the abyss. And oh my god, that was a headache. Then we lose the taunt. I'm like, seriously.
You don't take it's your fault. You're like, uh, where were you? Mumbo. Just one more. I think I actually, I did actually stop playing with one person, but that was because they kept calling me a name that I did not like. And I was like, mate, stop calling me that. It's like, oh, I'm sorry, and then call me again. And I'm like, didn't I just say, you know, uh, stop it? He's like, oh yeah, I'm, okay, yeah, yeah, I'm really sorry, then called me again, and I'm like, stop saying sorry, and then call me that. He's like, it's all I talk, and I'm like, <laughs> nah. No, 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 no. Ooh, puppy! Mighty Eagle. What baby is born with a nappy? Wish my baby was born with a nappy, that was a freaking mess of that. Funny to laugh at, but still. Poor nurse. You been a troll? You been around a troll? Yeah, there's loads of trolls. And now someone's playing out of daughter with me. Yeah. Someone's played the Grand Theft Auto with me after all the times I've been saying I want someone to play Grand Theft Auto with me. No one's played, but now they do. Which I told them the bridge came from is smaller compared to other trolls. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Yay, we got our first jiggy! And all we had to do was climb a freaking tree, which when I was younger, but this seems very impossible to do. I haven't played GTA Online, GTA, ugh, GTA Online for quite some time, actually. Because it just got frustrating trying to find people to do stuff things with. And then you had those players who they literally follow you everywhere. No, no, no. Bagger! At least I didn't die. I'm gonna get some health before I turn because <clears throat> mm, I should do because it'd be fun to actually play with someone and get some stuff. I think another frustrating thing about GTA is that it's really, really pricey. You know, you've got a Everything costs a ton of money. Like um, your casino, um, the penthouse. And then you've got the extras that come with it, and it's just. Why are you charging so much? I don't know if you played on the PS4, I'm going to have to see. I think we do have, actually have, we have Grand Theft Auto for the PS4 as well. That'd be interesting playing on the PS4. I should have to see about doing more online games on the PS4 because I barely do any. I'm not sure why I got a PS4. Problem I have is constantly getting killed by under players. Yep, I get that as well. It's more annoying when you're trying to do stuff like um, steal cars for your business. 
But I did have one good time with this one bloke. He was chasing me. And... Damn. <clears throat> he was chasing me, trying to destroy my car. And he kept on missing. And he, he had a helicopter on me, firing missiles. And I was like, haha, you missed. And he's like, okay then. So, <clears throat> I get another car. He tries again. And I'm like, you're very bad at this, aren't you? You can't hit me. And he goes, yeah. I was like, well, can't. he's like, I can't stay. I'll try and get you next time. He was a blooming great player. I loved him. At least, actually, at least he made it a challenge. I think the biggest pain is the has to be the parkours because they the person's designed it in a way only they can get to the weapons and once they get to the weapons that's it you're done for and the worst thing is they say oh but you can get a million dollars no you don't get a million dollars just do that try and get you watch that's it yeah the jet <clears throat> The jet is annoying. My brother's um, <clears throat> my brother's doing a, a supply run and the jet destroyed his stuff. And he's like, why did you do that? And he's like, well, you can have the jet. And he's like, anyone can get the jet. And that was just lame. I wonder if I can get the flowers with this or... Wait, let me. Ah, cool. They won't attack me. I got rough money after I was killed. Yeah, there's that. But yeah, GTA has a lot of annoying features, but I like the story. The story's cool. I mean, you've got Trevor, you've got Frank, and you've got Michael. Somehow they just work together. So well, I don't know how, but they do. Lost about twenty-seven thousand. No, twenty-seven thousand dollars. Ouch. That is a lot to lose. Okay, I'm gonna go into summer and I'll come back to be another time because I want to see the summer. I really want to know what it looks like be behind that mask. And I bet it's going to be Phil behind that mask. That's a surprise, motherfuckers, it's me! I played two missions as hard on after it. Yeah, I've actually managed to pull off the um, casino robbery. But well, I haven't been able to do it since. I've only pulled it, pulled it off once. And that was frustrating as it was. But it's kind of funny because the things like the Japanese or the Chinese, they um, sell off the casino to people who ran them down. And then they decide, you know what, we're going to piss you off and we're going to rob you blind. I forget how to do Oh, it's over there. <coughs> oh, the 
like I need to get a jump soon. I need to kick some assassin GTA on my Monday. Yeah, I have to set up. I haven't been on the PS4 for a while. But I do love my PS4 because it has White Day on it and White Day is amazing! Are we hungry now? We need five caterpillars. Okay, where's your mother? I mean seriously, where is she? It's not my job to feed you, I am not your mother. Oh, there's another one. You'll play more of a bird than Banjo. Yeah. Not a worry. In the second one, Banjo Tooie, what's really funny is um, Kazooie can actually get eggs to hatch. She sits on them, and after a moment, they hatch. So that's actually really fun. And I've got to wait till autumn to get up there. <clears throat> there are new moves in um, Banjo Kazooie. Like, um, you can ha there's actually a way where you separate them so Banjo and Kazooie can fight separately without each other. But I I actually watched a video about um, dark secrets behind Banjo Kazooie, and there's so many innuendos I did not see it. Like um, when Mumba does his spell, he goes "Oh my knackers," and if you say it slowly, "Oh my knackers," is what someone says when, well, it's what a man says when you're kicking in the testicles. "Oh my knackers." Yeah, there's Banjo too. That was like the best. Me and my brother were just absolutely belting when it came out. And before you ask, yes, I do have it. But they, they called it Banjo 2 instead of Banjo Kazooie 2. I'm not sure why. Oi! Gobi, how are you? <clears throat> well, yeah, you thought it was safe, but it's not. Now, give me water. There's plenty of water. What's actually really funny is you stand in a certain spot, it actually crawls into you. See? Of course I'm going to stream the second one. Delvin, why wouldn't I? No. The bees! Not the bees! The second one is actually a bit more frustrating because like I said the walls are connected. But it is fun. And where is that squeaking? Sora has squeaking for, for a battle for a caterpillar. Oh there it is. And uh, from right Mumbo doesn't actually do magic in this one. Up, 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 up
Too hot for magic. Mumbo wants suntan. Make any more than that. Surprised there aren't any birds around the bees. <laughs> oh. I never actually really. I know what the reference is, but I never understood why it's called the birds and the bees. It just sounds. Nah. I mean, is there like a thing for that? You know, like an explanation for the birds and the bees and they really looked it up. Maybe I should. Well, I can't be bothered now. I think I killed it, didn't I? Do a brain. All those Damn. All those birds just wanting a home. And I just took it. I don't get nah. What I do need is I need some gold feathers. How many do I have? Two. That's not enough. Because I need to go against a horde of bees who won't let me take the jiggy. No, no, don't you dare. No! Thank you. I should really stop shouting at the computer. Was the fact that I fell and took most of my health, or the fact that I fell off again? Yes, I know you need five caterpillars, and I'm not sure if you've got them. No, I don't. I've got to find them all over again. This bird is carrying the franchise and Badger is happily carrying the title. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. But, we got to be, be honest. Kazoo doesn't do much, apart from that. <laughs> I mean, she does all, she does a wind, she can play and insult people. I mean, she doesn't want to save too soon. Well, she's not very good for a friend. I mean, that's, a, that's his sister. Oh, 
Oh, come on. Where's the other one? Don't you dare that with me. Okay, the other one was over here. The boss fight coming sooner either. There is a fight with the bees in the hive, so I need to get more gold feathers for that. Um, I think that's the only one I remember so far for this level. Oh, there's another one. Nope. I'm just going to fall into that one. Yeah, I don't want to fight bees because, as you remember, when we went in spring, there was a cheeky piece and they're protecting it. But they won't let me have it, so I'm gonna have to go in and get it. But I need more gold feathers. Because if you put your protective shield up, they'll just attack you and that's it. There we go, I've got five caterpillars. Let's just stop trying to improve. Haha, uh -huh, miss me. Should I say that? That fat mini ass like it always does. Like that. What's actually really annoying is. Even after you defeat Gruntilda in her quiz, you've still got to go up to the top of the castle and beat her sorry backside. would be proud of you. Well, I'd beat the bees up. Yeah. Oh, I really don't like these twigs because even though they seem big, I always seem, I always seem to end up falling off them. Like, there's not enough room. Maybe because I've got a wide load.
and there we go. So we should be able to go through there, but like I said, I need more gold feathers. So once I get more gold, fe gold feathers, I will do that. No! Oh, I've got fun to go beginning. This is the only thing I don't like about this level is that you've got to climb the tree. I mean, it's kind of easier now, but when I was a kid, it was just freaking difficult. I could not do it. Where's the thing I'm done? There it is. But on the plus side, this path is getting better. Because if you, if you don't notice, it's wider. Well, it's longer. Why can't that third, third slide better? I don't know. You would have thought with it being a game, they wouldn't care about the wingspan. But they do. I mean, I've played loads of games where the wingspan... It's like drag, um, Western Dragons. They have wings, and the wingspan does, should not support you know, the weight and should not be able to fly. But somehow they do. So eight Chinese dragons don't have wings at all and they still manage to fly. Flag was it? Falco. Falco's look dragon. Has no wings, yet he flies. But neither does Superman and a lot of other superheroes. Well, you're meant to eat a ton. That's how you survive the winter. <laughs> I've got hiccups now. No, 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 please don't. Oh, fuck. Look at all the time. Well, this has started off at the beginning. Yeah, giant squirrel. It's a giant everything here. I can't die. I've, I've collected all the caterpillars. I'm not collecting them again. Hey, Phil. We finished contrast. That was the entire game we played the other day. Oh, fuck off. Now I've got to find those freaking caterpillars again. I am not a happy babe. I think that's the one thing I hate, like I said, I hate about this level is just I've got to climb the freaking tree and I always end up dying. So. I've got 
got to find those caterpillars. Yes, I know, I know, I'm going to feed you eventually. It wasn't as bad as when I was playing Division because, like I said, it was glitching as frick. And there was bad guys where there weren't bad guys, and it was just really frustrating to do that. Oh wow, it's actually getting really warm here in my in my home. Be nice to bees, but they're not nice to me. Neither are the birds, though I have a bird. I'm not a, whatever uh, term is. Pretty sure the term is bird fucker. You know what I meant, Phil. Oh, don't you start, don't you start. I'm trying very hard not to go down a microphone. Breaking news, Bungie was a soul. Breaking news, Phil is still a virgin. He just says he's not just to get guys. Okay, so we're almost back to where we were. Okay, this is where we got stuck. Okay. Okay, so jump and beat break. Yay, we made it! The boat! Now, here you go. One, two, true, I'm a virgin, pure as driven snow, just waiting for the big strong Don to teach you how to sex. Yeah, and you'll keep on waiting forever. For a big bird, he, for a very, he's very little. 
And it's actually good job I didn't have to chew and throw that up in the back of his mouth. I mean, that would just be gross for Banjo. Actually, no, because here we do it, I have to do it. Yay, we made it up again! And there's no prize this time. Come on, this could have given us a honeycomb for that. I will say more to this, but you may see me different in your head. Gee, let's think. You're a dancer funny guy, sometimes she surprised me with sexual innuendos, and my daughter constantly thinks that we are dating. There is nothing you can say that will make me think different, well, okay, maybe think differently for you, but there's nothing you can say that can shock me. I should have missed a gold feather, didn't I? But we don't judge here. YouTube might, but I don't. Unless you're about to say that garden peas are better than mushy peas, then yes, you can get out. He needs to be surprised, but Banjo is going crazy. Of course he's going crazy. He's got to save his sister from a magical witch. I just hurt myself, but at least... Where am I? <clears throat> Unless you're about to come out as a Scientologist, that will surprise me. Unless you are the worst way to serve these. Hey, I like Ushy Peas. It's like the ultimate thing to go with fish and chips. There's actually, a, I actually do know where a Scientology place is, though. It's in Edinburgh. <clears throat> And it is very, it, it is understandable to miss it because it's just, you know, on one of the busy streets, you know, the big build, you've got the buildings with, you know, the signs and stuff, and then you've got this door squished in between, like an alleyway door, that says Scientology. So it's like they're purposely hiding themselves, so you can't find them, but people who do go, go there. I mean, every now and then they'll have um, a sign out saying free personality test. But that's it. So if you blink, it's gone. You'll miss it. Apart, you know, in America, Scientology building seems to be big and massive and glorious. But in Scotland, it's like they're hiding because they know they're going to get the shit kicked out of them if pe more people knew they were there. It's just a simple blue door with a small thing saying Scientology <coughs> but I don't know if there's any more of them around but I haven't really looked for it so I just noticed it I was just looking out the window and then Scientology what and looked it up and it is a place I remember the last time I took a personality test, it came back negative. <laughs> oh, Phil. 
my baby fell. I think you need a hug. Well, due to social distancing, I cannot give you that hug. I don't know if I'm, well, I'm having more restrictions, so I according to the restrictions in Scotland, I cannot go to my sister's house because she lives in another town. I mean, it's about, um, I think about 15 miles away, but no, apparently I can't. Let us go to, where are we? Oh, did I tell you? Sorry. I think we should go to Wharton now. I don't know if the music's playing. You have to take personal test. What gives you. Okay, so you don't mind me asking. Yeah, actually, what, why would you want to take a personality test? The. How can I put this? They're based on opinions, really. It's always nice. You, oh, don't say you're actually going to go to Scientology for a personality test. Oh, do, do, do. No, 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 no. Please don't. I would say why not, but apparently, if you bad mouth Scientology, they will sue you. It's actually weird. You cannot talk smack about Scientology. Because they will sue you. I mean, really? Hang on a minute, I broke that. Let's have got to break it again. I'm just gonna go back to summer for a moment because I think I didn't break. I think I died and didn't break it. Yeah, um, all the people have talked smack about them, and that was it, they got sued. But I doubt that's going to work with me, because I have nothing, and I'm, I barely have anyone watching my streams anyway. The most streams I have on YouTube is a video I did years ago, and that was 300 views. Okay, I forgot to break it. You don't want to lie, it reset itself. If you do look at Scientology, it is a cult. Scientologists uh, use those tests to get blackmail on you to make sure you can leave. They're also big into what money you can get from they can get from you. Yeah, one reporter actually did the personality test, and they was like, "Well, you need to do this, and it's going to cost this much." And he's like, "Well, I don't have, I don't have ten thousand pounds." So he goes, okay then, so they called up his credit card and told him what to say to get his credit card limit extended. And that was just amazing that they managed to do that. And I need 10 cat feathers. No surprise. Well, that's two. But Scientology can try and sue me, I've got nothing really of value. I think the most expensive thing I have in my house that's, is my Batman signed photo of Heath Ledger and Christian Bale. That's it, that's only like, I got that for 90 quid. So that's probably worth 90 or 100 pounds. I do have a collection of Funkos. 
Well, of course, Scientology is more of a matter of organized crime. Yeah, true. But I think it does have a cult like status. Mixed in with organized crime. I mean, it depends how you look at it, because it's organized because it's got lawyers, defenses, etc. And but then it's like how they treat you, they keep you in, and the horror stories are just phenomenal. Oh, Gobi, you're still here. Signed photo of Heath Ledger and Christian Bale. I will join Scientologist to see you for that photo. Oh, Phil, that's not nice. I used my hard earned cash to buy that. And I did actually have a job at the time when I got that, so yeah. Oh, yeah, I've got, to, I've, got to, I've got to fight for that now. So if I get if I if I'm found dead in my home, we know who it is. It's Phil. Even if it's not Phil, I'll just say, I'll write in my blood it was Phil. Oh, I think she'll be able to actually look them up because I think 500 of them were made. I think it's 500. I'll have to look it up. Well, I'll have to actually have to look at the picture because it does state on the picture how many were made. Or was it 50? Something with a 5 in it. But um, yeah, there was, I got that Comic Con in Edinburgh, which was really cool. I got some sucker punch photos as well. Oh, you're always busy. In winter, he's like, I'm not in, I've gone on holiday, it's too cold. This is like the laziest I've ever seen him in the game. Yeah, Banjo would have been able to do it without Kazooie, but Kazooie wouldn't have been able to do the game, well, actually no. I would say Kazooie wouldn't have been able to do the game without Banjo, but if Banjo wasn't here, she wouldn't have done it. Because she doesn't care about TT. Can't really say that. <laughs> oh, go away. Oh, there you go, another one. One more to go. I do like this autumn setting though, I love the colours. Oh well, I 
look at that later. Without Banjo to protect her, Kazoo would be arrested for her numerous hate crimes. Well, yeah, Scotland is actually clamping down on it now. I mean, I've been a lot of adverts in Scotland saying, um, dear transphobics, we don't want your shit. Dear disabledists, we definitely don't want your shit. Dear haters, homophobes. Basically, they're sending out a message that there could be no more hate crimes in Scotland because they're sick of it. Which is going to be bad news for a certain somebody I know who lives in Scotland. Because suddenly they are transphobic. Yeah, we've all moved out and you're stuck there looking after the place. But you do have some notes and you have a will. Do you actually send me off that? No. I think we're basically clamping down on the Whole Equality Act for 2010 because people are saying it doesn't cover this, it doesn't cover that, when in fact it does. JK Rowling, yeah, I think it's covering that as well. Yeah. JK Rowling loves Scotland, but does Scotland love her? Uh, no, they don't. Yeah, I think she has gotten too rich. I mean, last time I checked, she's a billionaire or something now. Well, she's been a billionaire for a while. So it's either Powell's money's got into her head or she's trying to keep a lot of people happy to keep rich. Or she's always been a douchebag. What do you want? You need six acorns. Why can't you get them yourself? But you know, I'm going to find a flight path for that because I am not risking trouble on that one. Oh, got 11 caterpillars. Now, hopefully, I can get to. Big bird before I die. Okay, get settle, 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 settle. Stop pressing A. Ugh, I hate when I do that. You get in a panic and you keep pressing A and you're like, oh, and then you end up getting yourself in that bother. Oh, nice. me. You don't bite the hand that feeds you. Or in this case, pet the hand that feeds you.
With the size of the bird and the size of the nest, I don't know how this branch is holding it up. Is there an acorn here? No, there isn't. So now I've got to find six acorns for that freaking fat squirrel. I'm sure he's fine enough to survive the winter. Oh, there's one. Too. Uh, have I just done two pass casts on JK Rat? Well, I think I would have done one, two or three. No! Oh, that was so close. I think I've done one or two, maybe three podcasts on JK Rowling and her rubbish. But I won't repeat it because it's going to get me angry. Hey, Xavier. I need, I think, I do, I think I need, I want to actually be a bee in this. I'm gonna go down and see if I can be a bee. In this part. Because if I can be a bee, then it's gonna make things more easier for me. <clears throat> if not, I'm gonna write a strongly worded letter to Mumbo because I get him all these schools for him and his magic should stick if he doesn't I'm gonna kick his ass they do kind of get to do it in the second game Take a piece of them on this one. Five. No kidding around so much brown. I'll become tired of that and stand that very well. I also need to get the jiggy from the top of that flower. Come on, mate, do your magic. I 
can't believe the spell is at the end is Omanakas said very quickly. Ah, it is open already, but yeah, the jig is in summer. No, it's autumn, sorry. I'm a busy, busy bee. And I cannot do anything to defend myself. I've got no stinger. And I can't hit anything. Same freaking world. I call bullshit. <laughs> Seriously, call bullshit on that. Yeah. Banjo is now being confined shag the bee queen. Um the bee queen isn't until the second game. And I'm not joking. I think you have the honeybee, um, she, what does she want, you give her honeycombs and she gives you extra lives kind of thing, well extra honey slots. At least this, these honeycombs, ah, no it's not honeycombs, um, the acorns, are actually close, but oh, still not. Banjo never loses his shorts. So I say, when has Banjo ever lost his shorts? And why are the feathers, but there's no flight path? Pad. I mean, I'm hoping that if I get this right, then I should be able to grab that acorn and land in the water. If I do, I'll be happy. If I'm not, I'm going to be angry. Oh, fuck. Well, on the plus side, I didn't die. You're the queen bee sugar daddy in the second game. Yes, I am. In a matter of speaking, yeah. Is that a... No, that's how I won then. Let's just focus on the positive. I think I've got all the acorns. And which is really dumb because the only one that squirrel needs help with is two of them because I don't think the squirrel can swim or jump. But we got him. And we lived. Hmm. 
How many have I given you? There's two. I got one, one for there. One for me. That's two. Four. Okay, I've given them five. Great. Banjo shorts down, especially during sex. Well, I've got no experience in that department, but I'm sure Phil does. Seriously, there's one in his house. How lazy is this frick is this squirrel? That was an accident, and I drowned at the same time. And you're secretly rough. Are you sure, or is that just your preference? Because I'm sure Banjo called me the other day and said that all he wanted was a cuddle and you would not cuddle him at the end of it. Well, on the side, we're at winter and the flowers are dead. And the birds are gone. Actually, no way. I still need to figure out how to get that freaking puzzle piece. Because okay, I can't get I can't get the puzzle piece as a B. Maybe I can get it during the winter. I'll look at the winter. I'm in mind of where I'm going one day. No, nah, the flower's gone. So I've got to figure out a way how to get it. I put the snowman are back. Oh, and there's the flower pad I want. The um, flying pad I wanted. Don't need any of them red feathers. Okay, I'm sure I've heard of ginger. I believe that I can fly. Ha, got ya.
Uh, I think plus side is the birds in the wall, the hot the tree have gone. So that's one plus side. What's not good is that they replaced with snow. to try the um, thing again, the um, quiz. That's it, partly because I don't think I'm going to last what time we on. I should not have checked the time while doing that. I didn't sleep last night so I've been up all day and I'm like ugh. So I think I might actually try the quiz. I just gotta make sure I've got the cones. So I am gonna try the quiz just for a laugh. He must be going nuts for nuts for nut for a nut, but out of luck. For a nut, he's a nutty nut. Good night, Dover, that's a mouthful. <coughs> Yeah, I'm going to try the quiz and then I might call it night because I've been shattered. I've been doing my coursework and trying to figure out how to create YouTube videos, which I've never... Well, I've created a YouTube video and that was just one, so that was... Fuck you! That was simple because all I had to do was put pictures to music. You know, it is funny that on some of my happy few videos it says I can't make money off them because they're copyrighted because of the views that's in them but only a few are copyrighted okay Dolphin. Oh, I know where that is. If I put Gritty's layer, that'll be the correct answer anyway. to music. In the second episode we learned that Billy made the strip cheese slideshow on YouTube. Funny. Oh that's bug breath. That's a picture of oh. that right oh that could be anywhere I 
knocked off the other one. Because my mum burns my hand off quick clock wood. No, it sucks. Treasure Curve had a feature. What was the giant armoured creature? The giant hermit crab. Tiles await you too much. Time is tight, but that's the catch. I'm not going to do this. Damn. Oh, I can do this easily. The name on your game, you must spell backwards though, be quick as well. you okay. I usually curl up in a heap where does gritty like to sleep it's a big star. Remember now, before you lose, what type of toothpaste do I use? It's, um, moldy cheese. Freezes igloo isn't square. How many bears can fit in there? Okay. No. I'm just sure if there is a boat. What's his name? It doesn't float. Oh, it's the um Don't know. Treasure Trove's got a treasure hunt. How many eggs is you little hunt? Oh it's um Yeah, 
I'm actually halfway, kind of thing, just have to figure out where I want to go. I want to get some more health. Look at my hair, see it flow. What's it washed with? Do you know? Uh, send you oil. No, it's not. Yeah, it does get more health. Here's three answers, one you'll pick. What's my amazing party trick? Oh, it's, um... You blow b balloons with your butt. Inside Clank is spinning fast. What was tough for you to get past? Also for a strip tease. Well, unfortunately, you can't have a strip tease. The new stand is where I've been. What's my favourite magazine? It's um, that hag monthly. No. Don't be smart. You've not won yet. When I was small, what was my pet? I should use my, my thing. I'm gonna try again. That's Treasure Trove Cove. That's the lighthouse. Should not pick that up. Uh, which way should? Which way am I one today? I wonder who, if, what crowd is there. Oh, 
Remember this song you hear at my local strip club? <laughs> we go to a lot of strip clubs. I say, there isn't actually much in there apart from the shellfish. Oh, this one. I know, I've got 70 seconds. And with 17 seconds to spare, Banjo goes. Okay, which one should I go next? This one. The question is, what type of broomstick do I ride? A wooden one? I don't know. Is it this? Now let me think. What is Grunty's favourite drink? I'm going to try this for a laugh. See the picture on my screen? Do you know where you've been? If I get this wrong, I die. Oh, I die. Ugh. Okay, well, I'm going to leave it at that because I'm absolutely shattered. I'm going to have to do more revisions for this. But thank you all for joining me and I'll see you Friday. Where I'm not sure if we're if we'll carry this on or we'll start another game again. So I hope you had a good time and I'll see you all soon.